Dating Separate up, incidents that occurred today. We're going to go back uh, to the news conference that Nicole Comstock was talking about. This is Ventura County Sheriff's Department talking about that crash in Thousand Oaks. And injuries to a 14 year old female. The first incident occurred at 2 40 this afternoon at a Walmart in Simi Valley that involved an assault with a deadly weapon, resulting in two victims being transported to local hospitals. The second incident occurred directly following when the suspect fled the area of Simi Valley and traveled to the city of Camarillo, where a domestic dispute with family members occurred, resulting in no injuries. The suspect then later traveled to the city of Thousand Oaks and was involved in a single vehicle collision rollover that resulted in injuries to four juveniles, as mentioned previously. At this point, we do not know if the collision was an intentional act, as it was currently under as it is currently under investigation by the Ventura County Sheriff's Office, Thousand Oaks Traffic, and the Simi Valley Police Department. No arrests have been made at this time. We will be providing further information at a later time. In addition, there is no ongoing threat to the general public. Can I ask you, please, because we're live on Fox 11 right now, and sure. we came in a little bit into your statement. Mm -hmm. You said there's one fatality? There is one fatality, yes. And that's from the scene here on the boulevard? That's correct. So a 15-year-old? A 15-year-old male. And Where's then the it? other one you said, a 14-year-old, was there was an injury, a critical injury? Yes. And that was a 14-year-old. And there were two people in the stabbing that were hurt? There were two people in a stabbing, yes, involved at a Walmart. And in that Walmart store in Simi Valley? Was there a fight between the suspect and those two people? It's unknown at this time. I just know there was an assault that took place and they were later transported to a hospital. And the driver in that car, is that driver in that car in custody in the hospital? I, it, he's not, an, he's at the hospital at this time. But not in custody? Not in custody. What's his condition? Is he critical as well? It's unknown at this time. And what is his relationship to the customers of the, or, or the people in that uh, Walmart in Simi Valley? It, there does not appear to be a relationship. And so the bottom line is you have one fatality, you have two critical, you have two minor injuries from this scene, and then you got two people that were hurt at the Walmart in Simi Valley, and those people, what is their condition? It's unknown at this time. Everyone was transported to local hospitals. I don't have anything further on that. Okay, was there very good. a pursuit? Was he under pursuit? Or in there, that's unknown. All right. Does it seem Are like all the same person was involved? It, it is the same. It is the same person. And so what, the same. Was, the same suspect was involved in all three incidents. And that incident in Camarillo, there's some talk that, that the suspect may have gone there to get some kind of ammunition or something like that. Do you have any information at all about That's that? That's unknown. So nothing. You just know it was a domestic dispute in Camarillo. That was the second incident. Simi Valley, Camarillo, and then here in Thousand Oaks. That's correct. And are the kids, the four kids, the one that's deceased, the male that's deceased, and the three that are injured, are they all four? Westlake High School student? That I do not know. Do we know is, is the driver from Camarillo himself? It's unknown. I, I don't have any information on All right, we've been listening to uh, spokesman for the Ventura County Sheriff's yeah, Department, yeah, and the breaking news there is that a 15 year old male student has lost his life uh, regarding this crash in Thousand Oaks. Two other students are critically injured. Two are suffering minor injuries, and we understand the suspect is in the hospital. We do not know his, his condition. This resulted um, in a dispute that started in Simi Valley, a stabbing at Walmart, and then a later location at Camarillo. And the suspect ended up in Thousand Oaks near Westlake High School, where the car crashed and overturned. And as a result um, of what I just mentioned, we have one 15-year-old male who has lost his life.